Today, I'm gonna make a 3D printed golf ball and then later, hopefully shatter it with a golf ball. So first thing I did was I went into Fusion 360 and um, made a golf ball and then I proceeded to 3D print it. So designing and making this golf ball took a little bit of time. Um, I had to go through a few video calls and I even teamed up with some fellow YouTubers. Um, one of them was named Jared Hansen. For all of you who don't know who Jared is, Jared is a freelance structural engineer and he goes around and companies hire him. Um, he has some pretty cool videos on his channel. I would really highly recommend him. Very smart guy, and knows a lot about 3D printing things and make sure to go check them out. Okay, so now that we got the golf ball printed, we can go ahead and head outside and then hit it with a golf club, and hopefully it's not gonna shatter, but I really think it's gonna shatter because it's solid plastic and it's not really that soft. Like, it's really hard, so I'm pretty sure it's gonna break. Okay, so I couldn't get the GoPro to work. So I'm just gonna use the um, just the camera that I normally use, cause I really don't want to go all the way back up and get the GoPro um, SD card. Um, so let's hit it. <laughs> Okay, so this is one thing that really surprised me because I really expected the ball to take a lot of damage and break in half, but when I took a closer look at it, the ball only had like a few minor breakage and wasn't really in that bad of shape. Okay, so we're back here at the house and um, the golf ball didn't crack, so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, hopefully just chuck it at the house and hopefully see if I can break it.
the golf ball did break, but it lasted a whole lot longer than I thought it was going to last. The ball endured four attempts on the wall on you know, my house, and that's a lot. And I was like throwing it like a full pitch, and it didn't break to like the fourth attempt. So that's really good. And it withstood a golf swing. Grant, this would not be a good golf ball because it's solid and it really only went 50 yards when I hit the golf ball. But as far as durability, I'd give this a 9 out of 10. Because it was really solid. Like, even after like the third attempt of hitting the wall, it was still in pretty good shape. The fourth attempt really like knocked it out. Okay, it might have been a total fail, but in the process I learned some pretty cool things about different filaments and all that. Um, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.